did, uh, did someone deliver a piece of paper to you, Sam? Yeah, awesome. Oh, I know. That's an awkward way to get on the stage, isn't it? Why don't they put a step there? Let's say right with that. Um, uh, I want to thank Scarface for printing this out at the very last minute without our internet. Um, so, uh, we're going to do a song right now called The Princess Who Saved Herself. Uh, and, and what I need are uh, some volunteers to read the prince and princess part in, in the middle. <laughs> now, haven't, haven't you already done it once? You haven't? You have. Yeah. What? Well, oh, you did redacted, yeah. You say, I'm not sure you can volunteer somebody else. Yes, young lady, why don't you come up to the stage? Would you, uh, just to, uh, uh, you know, put your butt on there and kind of roll on, that's what I do. Now, do you want to play the, do you want to play the prince or the princess? You'll do the princess? Okay. We need a volunteer to play the prince. You just need to read. Yeah, why don't you come up and do it? Yeah. This should be good. So, um, these, because uh, they are an actual prince and princess. So you know, you know how this goes, and then it happens, and all that stuff. Okay. We'll be, we'll be playing some soft music behind you, and it's going to be awesome. I would say you should uh, maybe step over to Adam's mic when the time comes. Not now. Right now, you can just stand here awkwardly. I promise I won't lose. And now, we also haven't rehearsed this, so this should be fun. I always like to put a few things in there that we haven't really rehearsed, because otherwise it doesn't feel like a real show. Um, so this is called The Princess Who Saved Herself. Not necessarily for marriage.
all did a great job. We all get an A+. Plus. <laughs> high fives, high fives all around.